Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The space technology and exploration have huge potential. With the technological advancements, there are massive travel opportunities in next few decades. Until last few years, ISRO was the only name that existed in this domain but in last few years, many private firms and startups have started brewing. The number of startups in the space sector was just one in 2012 and has now increased to 47 in 2021. The two prominent names in the spaces are Skyroot Aerospace formed by former ISRO scientist and IIT alumni and Agni Cool Cosmos startup incubated at IIT Madras. The company is working on a space launch vehicle called Agniban. The idea behind setting up Agnikul was to develop and launch its small lift launch vehicle such as Agniban capable of placing 100 kg payload into a 700 km orbit. Basically, the company is targeting small micro or nano satellites to lower earth orbits which has problems accessing space through conventional launch vehicles which are very costly and time consuming as well. Just like Ola Share or Bus Service, the company's idea is to provide a shared launch services to small satellites, reducing the cost and long wait time to launch. The launch vehicle to be used by company is named as Agniban. This is customizable vehicle depending on the requirement. The rocket has overall length of 18 meters and diameter of 1.3 meters. It can lift 100 kg of payload at an altitude of 700 km lower Earth orbit. The total lift of mass of the vehicle is 14,000 kg. Now the biggest achievement of Agnikul Cosmos has been testing of their 3D printed engine and it became the world's first company to achieve this in early 2021. They have developed a 3D printed semi cryogenic rocket engine called Agnilet. The entire engine is just one piece of hardware from start to finish and has zero assembled parts. Typically, an engine has more than 100 parts built and assembled separately. But if you look at the main subparts of engine, they are fuel injectors, igniters and cooling channels. Agnilet's single piece of hardware combines all these three components into one. Therefore, the company does not have to spend days on complex assembly of parts and entire setup is ready within 4 days. This also increases the reliability of engine as there are no assembled components. As per latest report, the startup is going to apply for a patent for its full-scale second stage engine Agnilet. Agnikul Cosmos has also developed its own mobile launch pad which allows it to launch rockets from any authorized port. The startup is waiting final approvals from ISRO to launch its rocket from Srihari Kota. At present, company is working on testing and integration of various subsystems of Agniban as well. They have successfully designed, realized and qualified their engines. They have also successfully fabricated all propulsion systems such as pumps and motors and are actively placing orders for many of the large components of the vehicle such as tanks and structural subsystem. The company is planning for first commercial launch in the year 2022. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this. I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.